Hello. Space, 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 space. Space, 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 space. <laughs> I'm ready to fly into the sun and uninstall the game. I am ready to die in space. Finally, I'm ready to die. I have spaghetti. Uh, what happened to your mic? You you went away for a minute. What'd you say? Did I, I'm going to be having Thai food here in a little bit. Oh, okay. Let me get chat open. My mother, knowing me, got me a little... Uh, well, I wouldn't say a little. Like a big package of spaghetti for Christmas. And uh, I just cooked up some of it. Nice. It's, it's from Marshall's. I don't know. I don't know, it's weird. Case I'm moving without you biting me now. Have we calmed down? It's... It's like, uh... It's like thinner than I'm used to. Ah. Thinner sauce or thinner spaghetti? Uh, spaghetti. I'm using, uh, just butter. Ah. I didn't feel like getting sauce out. He's cute when he isn't scratching me hard enough to bleed. Yeah, both cats were being cute to me today. Did you see all the pictures of Alf I took? Yeah. No, those were all from today. Yeah, he was he was being real cute. And then I went to go see Penny. Hello, and... Grim. Hi, Grim. And then I went to go see Penny, and she was being cute. So, you know, the cats weren't being mean to me today, which was nice. Alf has been a little cretin. Not Alf. Yeah, Lord Alf. Lord has been a little cretin. <laughs> Alf's been a little cretin. But it isn't. Oh, is that Grim? Your cat is like the most cretin ever. Oh yeah. He uh, figured out he can kind of get on top of the fridge. Oh God. Which knocked a lot well, of stuff not, over. That's not good. And this is after he had uh, a little bitey episode where I had him on my lap trying to get him to calm down. Went to see if he was calm. Uh, nails straight into my finger. Mm. Mm. See, corn wouldn't like the top of my fridge. You know why? There's nothing there. No, there's three mouse traps up there. <laughs> ah, yeah, no, that's not good. Yeah, no, that would be bad. That's why the cats aren't allowed down here. It's because I got mouse traps. Hey, hey, but on the bright side, guys, I haven't caught a mouse in like three weeks. <laughs> I did end. I did catch like twelve, but they uh, <laughs> there hasn't been any for three weeks. So that's good. Yeah, that is good. I haven't seen a single mouse. Uh, welcome to stream. I'm eating spaghetti, so maybe I should finish it before we start. I just That's got okay. A, I need to that, eat. That gives the eat. menu screen all, enough time to be fun. Oh yeah, the logo will start dissolving. So we've got options. We could try and figure out the, uh, the Ash Twin stuff. There's still some aspects of Brittle Hollow you haven't managed to get to. I think Brittle Hollow... There's the you know, quantum. I, I had a the quantum. <laughs> Sorry. There's the quantum shard on Timber Hearth that we haven't found yet, That's and then right. there's also the entirety of the stranger. Not the entirety of the stranger. A good chunk of the stranger. I've discovered because... quite a bit. Mm, I've showed you how to do a couple things ahead of time. <laughs> Just because I think they're cool. Mm, actually, I think the. Pro you know what? Says, Mama mia, oh, hi, Frog. A spicy spaghetti. Oh, Frog, I haven't seen you in a while. <coughs> um, no, I think I think uh, I think the stranger's done. Actually, I don't think we have to go back there. I think we do because I want you no. to get a good. I want you to see. No. No, <laughs> no I'm good. I can I can guide you through the dark area. I'll. At the best of my ability. You know, I you know how bad it is. I I had a dream the other day that uh, I put a. <laughs> I had a dream the other day that I actually got to the quantum, <laughs> the quantum laboratory. <laughs> 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 I not that I not that I dreamt I was in outer wilds. I dreamt that I was streaming outer wilds. And I got <laughs> Horrible. 
Uite Tailante lo Pesquirel says you can lead a Ryan to water, but you can't to make him drink. Sorry, I have food in my mouth. Um, yeah, I'm gonna say like 90% of my dreams are just fucking boring shit. Like that time where I dreamt you were making fun of me for not knowing math. <laughs> Why would my brain like conjure a Brit that would make fun of me? Like, it's, it's my dream. Why does it have to be realistic? <laughs> Why? I literally, I, do I literally have had more dreams about you guys fucking making fun of me than anything. And I'm like, really? I wake up and I'm like, fucking seriously? <laughs> I get this in real life. Why do I need it now? The last time I remember you, because it, it was actually funny. I just woke up, and there was some part of my dream. There was something about how Brit plays Minecraft with the trackpad. Don't know why. That was just there for a second. I'm like, yeah, okay. <laughs> Maybe you want to throw the computer, but... That's easy, that'll be. Not everyone can yeah, dream about like... Shark Boy and Love a Girl. There, there was something about how you were like... That was back when you worked at Walmart. Mm. For some reason, <laughs> that was part of the dream. And then you were like... A com... What was it? You were like... A coder? Oh? But your office was on a wall? Oh. <laughs> Snowidea says Mr. Electric send this how, motherfucker to straight say, to I hell. I don't know how to explain the motion you made in your chair. <laughs> but that was like, you were spinning in the chair, but it wasn't the correct way to spin. Oh. Was it like... You were defying like, physics. Like Gmod spinning in a chair? He, um... Um... No. You were defying physics. <laughs> I like how Snow said, Mr. Electric, send this motherfucker straight to hell! Did I tell you guys that, um, I frequently have dreams about going to high school and having not done my homework and being really stressed out? Yeah. Um, my high school dreams are always, I don't remember. The, despite the fact that I went to high school and didn't do my homework and wasn't stressed out, for some reason, now I'm having <laughs> dreams about not doing my homework and being stressed out. Uh, and turns out, Isu has that exact same dream. So I'm like, okay, next time we have this, like, do Marco Polo with me. So Isu and I are trying to communicate via dreams. <laughs> I have high school dreams, but it's never the the homework thing. It's, I don't remember how to get to or into my locker. Oh. <laughs> Ever. Mine is, I can't, I, my, like, the layout of the school isn't my school. It's, like, fucked up. Yeah, yeah, I got, that too, that too. And it, it usually changes, but it's, I can't get to my class because I'm tired, which was a very real thing. And why I stopped going to school. You know what's fucked up? <laughs> I've seen this fucked up version of my school more times that I think if I went back to my high school, I'd be like, I don't know where anything is. Because I'm my... more used to the fucked up one for my dream. <laughs> my high school don't <laughs> exist anymore. They tore it out they tore that building down the year I like two years after I dropped out. Damn. And now it's a whole brand new building. Same with my elementary school. They did that to the high school in my town, but I didn't actually go to that high school. I went to a high school 20 minutes away. Okay. I'm still there, but I wish they burned it down. <laughs> uh, I just ate my pasta. And now we're going to play Outer Wilds. As you can see, the logo is kind of falling apart. Um, for anyone wondering, this is part four. Three, five. I think it's part four of Outer Wilds. If you're like, oh no, I missed the other parts. Eh. <laughs> All you need to know is I didn't fly into the sun. And last time he found the stranger. Yeah, we don't wanna, I don't wanna think about that. All right, let's resume expedition. I wanna get to that quantum fucking thing. So I'm going to fly the ship into it and land it in the quantum... Wait. 
Wait, we tried that. <gasps> yeah, please don't. Did that work last time? They fucked no. up the launch again. <laughs> Aw. So welcome back, everyone. Last time, last stream I did was uh, there goes the probe. Uh, last stream I did was the fuser stream. I wasn't around for that. Uh, I heard it was good. Yeah, we're looking for the quantum tower to fall through the black hole, or just kind, or we're trying to get to the. Uh, well, I want to shoot a. I want to shoot a scout at it. But you might need your scout to get to the Southern Observatory, which we still haven't gotten to because there's ghost matter on, on Brittle Hollow. That's right. Okay, fine. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, guys. I will stop sniffling. Imagine if I flew directly into the sun. <laughs> like, after not playing for a day, I just fly directly into the sun, and I'm like, well, that's it. Because if some of you don't know, uh, here is my agreement with this game. If I, there's the quantum moon. Uh, if I fly into the sun, I will uninstall the game. That's it. That's that's that. And have I flown into the sun yet, Britt? Nope. Yeah. Here we are. Uh, but I did almost. But I meditated in time. <laughs> so it didn't count. I died before I hit the sun, okay? Doesn't work. Doesn't <laughs> you count. You didn't die, you passed out before you hit the sun. Uh, best point of entry would probably be the escape pod. I, Oh, I would assume. Yeah, the escape pod is probably the best way to get Which in there. Which is... Well, here's another way. But I don't know if that's You better. did pass the escape pod earlier. Oh, shit, did I? Yeah, it was on your way landing. Oh, shit. I saw the... you just didn't land. I saw the gravity cannon. I don't... I don't, that wasn't Have the great gravity cannon. Yeah, that's the fucking rock. Okay, there's that. Still haven't gotten in there. Yeah, that's the observatory we're still trying to get to. There's a, there's a lot of things we... This this planet, despite being one of the easiest, uh, is causing me great pain. Where the fuck is this escape pod? <laughs> I must be well, in the wrong axis. I have to be. Yeah, you're going in a circle one there, way, there it and is. it's probably not there. There it is. Uh, Ryan, get the banana. Okay. Chris! Stop! <laughs> stop, Chris! Stop! stop. <laughs> Chris, stop! Get banana, Chris! Wayne delayed the gnome finale. I guess Wayne yeah. isn't feeling very well. Uh, but it'll be happening on February 4th. I'm excited to see the end of the gnome adventures. I'm glad that you guys finally got to see uh, the Sonic Underground song. You linked me that. Yes. That's what I mean. I, I, it did not have music over it when I watched it. I know. It. I'm, glad, I'm glad he did that with the little like, sing-along. Yeah, because I, I watched all the gnome... The minute I saw those gnome videos go up, I was like, all right, I should probably just watch the VODs because I can watch these faster than you can edit the videos. And I saw that Sonic Underground thing, and I was like, holy shit, this is hysterical. But enough about gnome. Let's see. This is not the Hanging City. But it's the road to it's, the Hanging City. Is it? Okay. Because that big white uh thing... Big, that's it's called that's a bridge. Brit. My name is Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> the big bridge. Oh, 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 oh. I forgot the word bridge. Oh, oh. Uh, oh, look, the mines of Moria. I love Lord of the Rings. Hello, doodles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, also, ah! you Why? I. What? Yeah, Brit. Yeah, Brit, because I meant to do that. For sure. <laughs> this helps us, doesn't it, technically? Yeah, kind of. Um, we also still need to go into the Dark Bramble and find the vessel. Oh, yeah. 
But isn't that kind of end game shit? It's it's only end game if you know everything you gotta do for it. It's very vital to find it first. So how's the race going? Oh, hi, Doodles. Uh, fine. I haven't flown into the sun yet. This is the quantum museum. But you did fly into a yeah, that's black a quantum hole. museum. But you should get to yeah, it from there. Oh, I can get to it from here. I think you can. There's okay. the couple of roads that lead elsewhere over here. There's we just the... gotta find where the no, bridge there's is. The, there's the bridge. Okay. It was back there, so I should probably go back. Uh, is there an easier way to go back? I don't know. Doodles, can you talk think, for a minute? I think you can send the, that yeah. uh, the other okay. way. Okay. I'm just, uh, I think you're a little loud. Am I a little loud? Yeah, it's not your fault. I have turned you down. It's okay. Okay. All right. Hold on. There we go. You should be able to turn the portal tubes the other way, I think. Uh, I have to turn them from over here, though. Yeah. Okay, so we can't do this yet. Because this has to be in space. The one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. The one place that hasn't <laughs> been corrupted by capitalism. Space! <laughs> Thank you, Tim Curry. I love how much read. he pauses. Like, he's trying to yeah, not he's laugh. Yeah, he's trying not to laugh, dude. <laughs> Space! <laughs> you can walk on the wall here, I think. Can I? Oh, shit, you're right. Yeah, my favorite thing about that is the fact that that was obviously the best take they had of it, too. Because they had to use the one where he almost started laughing. Well, it was Command & Conquer 3, I mean... There already made three of those. Like they had time for more than one. Yeah, character. I know they already made three of those fuckers. Uh, Merm says that didn't age well. Yeah, I suppose you're right. It didn't. Jeff Bezos no, went up there, didn't, didn't he? It did not age. Corn still oh. doesn't need. No. No. no, but he wants. I don't know. A Taiki and Nyx don't really need. The line I just said was pretty funny. I know. But it was also... You can it was, always get what you want. Aw, uh, R.I.P. Meatloaf. No, that's not a Meatloaf song. No, it's not. No, what's what's the Meatloaf song? It's, oh, my stones. Uh, um, oh, and I would do anything do for love. Anything That's it. Love. Uh, what I said, I don't, uh, they don't need, they want. That is a line from Twin Peaks The Revival. <laughs> uh, okay, Britt. Honestly, just explore. Have I been? Yeah, I've been over here. Uh, you moved something in the Black Hole Forge last time, but didn't get on top of it. I did. Didn't get in it. So if you want to just honestly, I, I, think I don't I could, know. I think I could get into it from down there. No, the first well, time the... Ankes and Seth and Bonk, do not separate them post. That's the Black Hole Forge, the thing on the rails. Yeah. Okay. Which is the walk. It's got its own special walkway down to it. Right. Okay. Oh. No, I was doing uh, Copyright, copyright, element. copyright, DMCA. <laughs> yeah, because was that accurate. Uh huh. Now remember, there's ghost matter over here. Okay. But oh. you you can use your picture, your, your signal scope to yeah. walk around it if possible. There was a scroll over here you needed to read to, and we ended up dying. Dying with yeah, it. Yeah, I remember. Oh, I hate this planet. I don't want to live on this planet anymore. I don't want to live on this planet anymore. Great. Why'd you make him British? I didn't. 
I don't want to live on this planet. Oh, I did kind of. I can't. I don't know, Professor. I don't know how to do Professor Professor Farnsworth voice. Mm. E gods, you are my nephew. My great, my uncle. What? Ah, uh, great, great, great. Uncle, I uh, fuck. I gotta rewatch Futurama. You can watch with me. I'm in the middle of season five. Oh man. Good news, everyone. Good news, everyone. Picard really was British as a kid. Oh, I found the school, Brit. Oh, nice. You should go read some of the crusty handwriting. Explanation it's of festivals. All the Nomai clans from all over the universe meet in one place at a time to share what they've learned in science and art. It's called the festival. At some festivals, one clan's big discovery can meet all the Nomai get to advance too, like a Nona's Warp Core, which means it so everyone, which made it so everyone can warp long distances and explore more. Each clan has a festival at Envoy to show their most interesting work. Our Envoy was Thatch. A single festival could last a long, long time. We can't go because we're stuck here, but Felix says we used to go, too. Don't forget, festivals happen every ten years. Maybe handwriting. Formation of the universe. Look who wrote this one. Oh my god, baby Solanum. No one knows how this universe was made, but one thing we do know is everyone used to be very hot, and everything used to be very hot and very dense, tightly packed together. As this early universe expanded, it also cooled down. Once it had cooled down enough, particles were able to group together to form things like galaxies, stars, and planets. Since then, space has continued to expand at a faster and faster rate. <laughs> Merm. <laughs> Which is hard to think about for too long without your brain hurting. This universe will keep getting colder and larger until one day the stars and life they support will all die. That's scary to think about. Yay, even, though, even though Conoid tells me it won't happen in our lifetimes, but it will happen in someone else's someday. Uh oh. The inevitable heat death of the universe. Uh oh. That applies to our universe too. Fun fact, kids. Doodles? The fuck is wrong with you? There's a teleporter up there. Why is it upside down? Because that's on the other... I'm pretty sure the teleport's on the other side of the surface. Huh? The actual teleporter, I think, is on the other side of the surface. Oh! You're looking at- you're looking at the roof. Alright, you're looking at the ceiling, not the roof. Okay. I don't want to be over here anymore. I've decided I don't want to be over here anymore. I explored the school. That's what you kept whining about. <laughs> <laughs> Because I think the Fuck. fact that the school is cute. Yes, the remnants of... Doodles! 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 They Doodles, lived already... two million years ago. And we already met one of them. I'm just here to ruin everybody's good time. Yeah, I know. Fuck. <laughs> should I jump down? Uh, no, you should go up to the actual Black Horde the black hole forge controls and actually get that to move up. Yeah, but then I can't get into it if I get it to move up. I think you can get into it better if you move it up. Oh. I was scared out of my mind when I was a kid and I learned about 2012 and let it ruin my school summer vacation that year. The year? Yeah, the December 21st, 2012 under the mind calendar. What? The what? Apocalypse? You don't remember that not happening? What? When? In 2012? 2012? Yes. 
No, I don't remember the apocalypse happening. No, I said, don't you remember it not happening? <coughs> no. Yeah, I it remember it. It was supposed to happen, I but it didn't. There was a, there was a thing? I, I mean, I know, it's, I know it's been ten years, but, like, you don't remember? I, I it's not I, that I don't remember, it's that I don't think I was aware. <laughs> How could you not? It was all over the news. I... In 2012? I was yes. a high schooler. I had my first girlfriend. <laughs> you think I gave a shit about the I was also in high school. Did you have a boyfriend? Um... On December 21st? Yes, actually, I did. Oh. Alright, my brain is... I don't know, man. What is the eye of the universe? The eye is older than this universe, so imagine so much it could teach us. Suppose the eye is a more advanced being. The eye of the s the eye is the source of the signal that brought us here. I used to legit, I used to think it legit would be because I was tinier and was constantly hugging my mom and agreed to let my brother play Cars 2005 at the time. What? Perhaps it is a cosmic library. How can the eye be older than the universe itself? Suppose it's a relic from a previous universe. The early universe was unimaginably hot and dense. If anything existed before, it would have been destroyed. Suppose the universe is older than previously assumed. What is the eye's signal? Suppose the eye wishes to communicate. The signal is the eye's voice. It speaks a language we do not yet know. Or maybe the signal is the eye's attempt at expressing itself. The signal is a call. Were we indeed, and were, the in, were we the intended audience? From the signal, we were able to determine the eye's approximate age, or perhaps its lack of age? Be welcomed in this place. This shrine is a space to reflect on what brought us to the star system, the signal from the eye. We observed the eye's signal in our travels and followed it here to find its source. What we do know is this. The source of the signal, which we have chosen to call the eye of the universe, is older than the universe itself. The rest we have yet to learn. Enter and open your mind to its possibilities. Enter. I think we already have entered, haven't we? Right, I think that might be the, uh... Huh? The Southern Observatory. Then how the fuck do I get in? Oh. No, I thought that was an opening. How do I get in? I don't know. Oh, Brett, <laughs> you're not very helpful. I watched Vinny play at the same time you did. I need to make progress. Fuck. That's up. Which means you could technically fall down there and check stuff out, because there's at least two more of those pillars going straight up. Oh, that doesn't go anywhere. Hoping there was an entryway. What happened? Why are they? Why are they all dead? What happened? Did the ghost matter get all of them? Every living creature in your in that the sucks. Parthian solar system. If they weren't uh, aquatic or already dead, it killed them. I remember watching the mermaid show thinking it was real. Oh, H2O! I no longer believe, as I did as a child on Ever Twin, that the eye of the universe, the source of the signal, wishes to harm us. But it may not want to be found, either. In fact, the eye might not have wishes at all. We have no evidence supporting this. 
The terrible circumstances of our arrival here was most certainly exactly that circumstance. I suspect imagining we are special to the eye in some ways wishful thinking. The eye might have called out to enti any sent entient entient species. Any and we know that it's called at least two people to the two uh, species to the solar system so far. Yes, the owl, the owl, elks. One sec. Or it might not have been calling out at all. That my ancestors heard the eye signal holds no great deep meaning. This wouldn't be so bad, I think. Solanum again. Also, I'll be right back. I saw. How do I so is dark matter like antimatter or dark matter? Or... It kills. It kills you. It well, I got that. It bad. How do I get in? Damn it! They're like, "Oh, welcome," and it's like, "Fuck you!" There's no way in. He wants another unsettling space fact. No. Too bad. We call it dark matter because there's just a bunch of gravitational forces in the universe with no dweeb, matter to dweeb, it dweeb alert. So we're just like, eh. okay, well, there's something they're doing something, so we're just gonna call it dark matter. Nerd. What's this? And it takes up 90% of the universe, and we don't know what it is. I imagine I've been hard on Poke again. This in turn means I've made many things difficult for her sister, Clary. If Poke and I are oil and water, Clary is our emulsifier. She certainly makes us a better team than would mixing through shaking, although sometimes I would like to shake Poke. Jokes aside, suppose my own fear of never finishing the eye prompted my argument with Poke, finding the eye. That would be immature of me. I should apologize, at least to Clary, who could then tell Poke. That is not the entrance to the thing. It's not? No. Well, the thing's up, though. Damn it. Brit. It, it seems like at the end of all of their life, they're like, well, maybe the eye didn't actually call to us. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, dude. <laughs> or maybe it did call to you. It's just calling you to kill you. Calling? No, I don't think it. No. I don't think it has a brain. Well, that's what. That's what the other guys started thinking because they found that came to it, read about it with like their weird light technology, and it showed them dying and the new life springing forth. And they're like, "We're gonna there's, die." There's, there's no way up there. I'm not. I'm giving up on this. But if they die and new life springs <laughs> forth, then it's the circle of life. I don't think it's that's homestead. They're gonna, they're gonna, they're I killing the old universe. Oh, you're kicked from the voice call. That's fair. What's up, Brett? I swear that's. I don't know. I think that is the way into the Southern Observatory. I don't know any other way that it could be. I thought you were gonna say you think I was right, and I was like, please don't. Is there. There's another uh, story, but it's broken. Damn it. Try the other walkway? I did. It's also blocked. Uh, Safe. Well, then I guess we only get there from the top floor, oh, then. Wait, hold on. Ah! Nope. Just swoons on in. Oh, of course. Swoons! Uh, excuse me. Gross. Um, Sorry. So, where was that switch for the the thing? I don't remember. Uh, it was over on the turn to your right. Um, I think it's going to be one floor up. Okay. It's going to be a little hallway if you walk to your right here. Oh. Right here? No. Oh. It's going to be in the ice. Oh. 
Oh, like here? I believe so, yes. Ah, yeah, this looks like it. Okay, so... That goes up, and then... You've can... got two minutes of the loop left. God damn it! I hate this planet! We're coming back and we're doing this first. I think you okay. can I think you can access it from the from the surface. Cause I think that's okay. where that teleporter is. I think that teleporter is on the surface. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. I'm just gonna meditate. Fuck it. <laughs> So, we read a bunch of stuff, but I don't think any of it actually went into the ship's log, so... <laughs> a good amount of it did, I think. Oh. You can check the log. Okay. Where's my phone? Oh, fuck. Did I bring my phone upstairs? I forgot to bring it back downstairs. Where is my phone? Here it is. Where? What are you doing? Uh, what are you doing? Why are you making that noise? <laughs> I'm making a timer for 15 minutes. Okay. Okay, I'm going to fly directly to Brittle Hollow and shove my fucking fat space head. Thank you for saying head. Directly up. What's his face's ass? Here we go. I couldn't remember his name. What's his name? Ryback? Yeah, Ryback's ass. Whoa. Why am I dropping frames? That was weird. This happens in the Buzz Lightyear film. You're right. Is that the teleporter? Shit. Yeah, see, there's the teleporter. Yeah, no, that's what I was trying to say. What? No, I... Yeah, I know, Brit, but, like, this is also where the, the, uh... The Black Hole Forge goes. Okay. It goes up. So I believe there must be an entrance point around here somewhere. Possibly one of these holes. Okay, so... Fuck, what would be the best entry point? I don't even know. I swear to God if this says Black Hole Forge. Okay. Hey, there's a quantum moon. Ah! <laughs> what the fuck? Take me down. I, Ryan, I, this teleporter was broken, I know! Remember? It was a joke! Alright. What the Scotty, fuck is that? Scotty, beam me down. Oh, it's the interloper. <laughs> there it goes. Bye.
I like how Brit's like, I'll hold, I'll be hand holdy. Brit's not very helpful, guys. Brit's, <laughs> Brit's actually Brit's not. Doing, Brit's doing their best. Brit's mm, not good enough. <laughs> I love the game. I'm not a walkthrough. Not good enough, I think. <laughs> I can help with what I know. I'm <laughs> just being needlessly mean. Don't worry about it. Why are you slamming British people? I'm sorry, British people. Play portal. No, don't be sorry. I'm <laughs> Play portal. <laughs> You're right. If I played portal, this wouldn't be happening. Because I wouldn't need Brit to tell me what to do. <laughs> Yet I still would. Yeah, and I'd mute you. Can I just walk on the ceiling from here, you think? Uh, you, you could try, trajectory-wise. Hey. I don't know where I'm going, but... Wait, you're really early in the loop. The last time you did this, we got, like, mm. sidetracked. Yeah, this was... might actually take you to the observatory. I hope so. Yeah, last time it was broken, right? Yeah. It looks like it goes into the ice. Yeah, I see that. I don't know what's there. Okay, I can't tell. Are you saying ice as in frozen water or eyes as in plural I? Why ice. don't you take a look at the stream? <laughs> There's ice, Doodles. There's ice. I'm in it. Is there? Yes. Yeah. Is that what that is? Yes. Yeah. Okay. The blue thing? Yes. Guess we're going up. I hope this leads to progress and not not progress. I'm almost out of fuel already. The loop just fucking started. What's up there? What is this? You're out of fuel because you set yourself flying. Yeah. So where am I? What the fuck? Those bad stairs? <laughs> I think you are. Oh, that's ghost matter. Is it? It was down there, yeah. School district? Yeah, this might be the school district again. But still, I got here faster than I would have. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it is. Uh, alright. So. Let me get over here. This <laughs> almost certainly will lead to my death. I lived, bitch. <laughs> I lived, bitch. Oh, there goes one of the bridges. <laughs> How's everyone doing? Good. Need anything? All right. Need, need anything? Need water? Um, I could go for a Sprite. Want some cookies? Can you... <laughs> there is no Sprite. Sprite doesn't exist in this metaphor metaphorical universe that I'm creating. <laughs> Fine, I'll have a Sierra Mist. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, Sierra Mist exists, <laughs> but Sprite doesn't. It's a better universe. So that goes up. And connects to something. <laughs> what are you laughing about? Goes up and connects to something. That's pretty much all of the game. <laughs> Where's the uh? Oh, the snake sprite isn't real. Fuck! All bridge is broken. All the bridge is broken. Where is the quantum knowledge? There it is. 
In the quantum library. Well, there it is. I'm looking at it. Remember, aim high. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay. So, keep an eye on that. I can close this now. Uh, I want to... Oh, let's hop back into the black hole. How is the sun already that bad? Ooh, surface integrity 10%. Yeah, this loop doesn't feel like it's been that long, but whatever, I guess. Uh, I'm going to the black hole. I'm going to hop into the white hole station. Well, should we even bother? Because... How much time I would say wait around until there. Our... How much time's left on the timer? Well, I want to go get my ship. Oh, up to you. No, kitty again. Fuck. I'm almost out of fuel, which I forgot about. Yeah, 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 yeah. Every night there's this kitty that that comes by my door and just cries and cries and cries, and I don't know why. Sounds like my everyday life. <laughs> oh yeah, how is? Uh, oh, ow. He's fine. Where the fuck am I? Oh. <laughs> it's like, what? Is he getting along with... No. Uh, <laughs> no. <laughs> Absolutely fucking not. Uh, but also, Penny is still very small, so... Hopefully they'll get along a little better when she's older. Any fuel here? No, of course not. There'll be fuel outside of the teleporter, though. Ah, there goes the scout. The Museum of Quantum Knowledge is in space, folks. No, I think you're passing... Oh, orbiting? Yeah, you have this spinning because your ship was also close to it. Yeah, good point. Speaking of ship, good thing I parked it here. Uh, there it is. That. Brit, how's Corn doing? He bit me very hard and knocked stuff off the top of the fridge earlier. Yeah, Kitten's doing that. I would have thought- Chad, if you have pets, tell me how they're doing. I would have thought the entrance point would be around here. It goes up to the surface. What the fuck am I missing here? Down here? No. I'm pretty sure it's all underground stuff. That's so fucking annoying. I hate it. Or what about that blue light to your side? Or is that the teleporter? That's the teleporter. Wait! Mom, why do you the hate teleporter! Your Wait, the teleporter! No. Just sends you back to Whitehall Station. Damn it! That's why it's a teleporter. Well, why was it active? I don't know. That's why I, <laughs> I asked. I think the game glitched. Or maybe it just glows if it's active. Maybe. All right, fuck it. I'm going to go to the Quantum Knowledge Museum. We got to get something accomplished here. Starboard all day. I don't give a fuck. Surface integrity 5%. Hasn't gone through yet. And you know what? We're taking the fast route. Let's go, boy. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> And now we wait. I, I'm going to make progress, chat. Alright. I'm, I'm sick of Brittle Hollow. I need to make progress. Next time, I'm jumping into the fucking forge while it's down. I'm not even going to press up. Surface integrity, surface integrity is now three. Oh, 
I'll be right back. I'm gonna order dinner. Fine. Okay. Fine. Abandon me. I'm not abandoning you yet. I'm <laughs> Go get your food. You got my phone. Go get your it's food. It's not ready yet. I have to figure out what to do for dinner. I ate spaghetti. And now I'm here. In space. Staring at a orb that shouldn't exist in reality. Where the fuck is this quantum knowledge museum? I'm pondering the white hole. Which is also what I call my mouth. <laughs> Come on. Hole. Come on. You know, my <laughs> My dad refused to believe me when I told him that spaghettification was a scientific word used for black holes. <laughs> Granted, it does sound ridiculous, but it is the correct term. It is. I've heard of it. Surface integrity is zero. Timer just went off, so it is 15 minutes then. Okay. Okay. It's moving. Here it comes. There it is. There it fucking is. Let's go. <laughs> there it is. No! There it is. There it is. Oh my god. Fucking yes, finally. Oh, okay. Shit. Finally. I was not paying attention and I just got killed by a bokoblin. I don't know what that is. Very basic Zelda enemy. Zelda? What are you playing Zelda for? Is this 1982? It's, it's um, 1986. What's that? Oh, there's shit. Oh, there's shit here. Okay. Yeah. I need to learn the shit. I need to learn the shit before the loop's over. Give me the shit to learn. I called earlier and asked if this place had the sushi, like, chef today, and they said yes. I called and asked for sushi and said, oh, no, they're not here today. Oh, no. What? Mmm, sushi. <gasps> That's what I can have for dinner! I have pot stickers I can throw in the oven. Okay, nerd. Okay, I need to... Fuck. Stop! Okay. Why am I still floating? Stop. Pause. Why no pause? That's, that's how momentum works. No, I'm supposed to pause. The game's supposed to pause when I'm reading. It's because you're moving. Oh. Match velocity Fuck and you'll me. stop. How? There. Jesus. I didn't know you could even do it with the fucking jetpack. Welcome, Solanum. Your arrival here means you've completed your preparations on Giant Steep and are ready to depart for the Quantum Moon. Fuck. On your pilgrimage, the quantum moon will carry you, just as it carried me and many of our clan before me, to the moon's sixth and most secret location. You'll be aided in your pilgrimage by the shrine of our clan built on the quantum moon. But remember this final rule. To explore the sixth location, the shrine must be on the moon's north pole. Ah. Be curious <laughs> on your journey. Ah. This is, uh... Yeah, we kind of broke, we kind of broke sequence there, but oh well. Yeah. How do I put down the scroll? Fuck, I can't put it down now. Oh, fuck. Brit? <laughs> what? I can't, I can't put down the scroll. You should be able to match velocity or something. Or just like... I can't. You can't just kind of throw it? No. No. Oh, is this empty? Oh, thank God. No, stop. 
I hate this fucking place. Stop! If you're here to make your first pilgrimage to the quantum moon, you are almost prepared to set out on this deeply significant journey. Before you do, pause and remember your history. We make this journey not only for ourselves, but we also to honor the members of our clan who came before us. Those who, after the crash that brought them to the star system, became stranded on Brittle Hollow and Ever Twin, with no communication between those two groups of survivors. These Nomai looked upwards from two different planets and saw the same wandering moon visiting their skies. It was this moon, the Quantum Moon, that kept their curiosity alive during this long period of hardship. After the two divided groups were able to reunite, it became our clan's united goal to find and visit the Quantum Moon. This took time, and many Nomai who dreamed of seeing the Quantum Moon died before we discovered how to make the journey. When you reach the Quantum Moon, recall these Nomai and carry their curiosity onward with you. Oh, it's all the, it's all the planets are up here. And it'll tell you, I think, where the Quantum Moon is uh, currently. Uh, oh! Uh, so. That's cool. I mean, we don't ever need to go there again because we sequence broke. Yeah. I didn't need to go in here. <laughs> oh, well. So it was, now, it was for funsies. Now, Brittle Hollow is just trying to get into the Southern Observatory. Fuck that Southern fucking Observatory. You want me to look it up? No. <laughs> where... Where are the things? Oh, they probably floated off to space. Gone forever. My power ring. <laughs> I don't think they would float off like that because they're like skeletons and stuff. Also. Uh oh. Just like. Uh oh. Well, it's not gonna matter in a minute here. My power ring! Gone! Why don't you attach yourself to the gravity wall? Ah! What? Why don't you just attach yourself to the gravity wall? There's a gravity wall? Right, enter to your right. Oh. It's part of the pathway there. Yeah, well, I'm about to run out of fuel and die, so. This will be fun. Oh! Where be ship? Ow. Eh. Two minutes. Yeah, that's fine. I think I explored everything on the quantum moon. That's not the quantum moon. Whatever, the quantum observatory. Tower that's not quantum. the observatory. Whatever, the tower of quantum dogs. Why do you hate me so much, Brit? <laughs> I can't- I don't know why Britt and I are friends, since apparently they hate me. I don't. Well, why don't you help me? <laughs> Cause I don't remember that much about the game either! I offered to help. I've looked up walkthroughs on how to get to the observatory and it didn't make sense. <laughs> We've tried to follow it and it wasn't that way. <laughs> Can you let the sun do its thing? Because there's people who probably haven't seen it yet. All right, fine. What? What? Uh, it's just suddenly on fire. Oh. In the game. Oh. It's because a dragon snuck up on me. They can YouTube. Yeah, Brit, YouTube it. It's not cheating if the tips don't touch. 
<laughs> Why did I say that? <laughs> How to get to the south? How to get to the Southern Observatory Outer Wilds? How do you get to the south? Oh, thank God nobody talks on this. The tips of our noses. Um, it doesn't count if the, that, that sun got me, right? <laughs> Did you? No. Okay. <laughs> I didn't actually think about that. Oh, that's right. I didn't fly into it. The sun flew into me. Okay. What if I linked you this and you watched this three minute video? Sure. I'm gonna DM it to you. Okay. It's literally a video called How to Get to the Southern Observatory. Excellent. Third top comment, 89 thumbs up. Thank you, Brittle Hollow was really starting to piss me off, it's, smiley face. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Okay, uh, while you do this, I'm going to go grab food. I'll be right back. Okay. Well, they entered at the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. Oh, there's one that goes up. What? What? Hold on, chat. I'm just... I'm kind of skimming through this. Oh, this is really convoluted. No wonder I n never found my way to the fucking place. I find that that's always the thing with walkthroughs. Either it's something super obvious that you kick yourself for missing, or it's completely impossible to figure yes. out on your own. No it's, in between. It's definitely not that. It's definitely not obvious. Oh my god, no wonder I never fucking found it. Alright, let's see if I can replicate Don't this. Don't hit my horse. How dare you hit my horse. Don't hit thy horse. Okay, suit, ship, brittle Wait. hollow. How, how does Vinny say lizard? Lizard? Lizard. Lizard. There's Riddle Hollow. Super Lizard hitting my horse. Everyone? The tropical rouge. Good news, everyone. Good news. Bad news. If bad news, nobodies. Uh, there's uh, the last episode of Tropical Rouge Precure is next week. Ah. Yeah, it makes me very. That's sad for you. It is. It well, it's sad for everyone because it's the best season ever. <laughs> Better than Alo mode. Uh, well. Depends who you ask. I think Tropical well, Rouge is. You. I think Tropical Rouge is better than Sweet. Well, uh, Alamode's not my favorite season. It's not. No. Sweet's oh, my I it was. Sweet's my favorite season. I think uh, Sweet, Fresh, and Go Princess all come before, in my mind at least. Not in Isu's mind. Isu loves Kira Kira. The anime girls will die. So sad. Well, the thing is, usually we have, like, three years of crossovers. But because of COVID, they haven't been doing those. 
So, uh, this could be the last time I we ever see the Tropical Rouge girls. Which is a harrowing thought, considering the fact that uh, they are lovely and I like them a lot. But, uh, yeah. This could be real sad on Saturday. Real fucking sad, my dude. Alright, and then they went over here. Oh, you know what else is sad? And they went into here. For you, but not for me. Mm hmm. Tom Brady's not going to the Super Bowl. Why is that sad for me? Because you're a Patriots fan? He's not. Not I... anymore, no. but I thought everyone. He's not in the Patriots. <laughs> also, I fucking hate Tom football. Brady. Why would I give a shit? I know nothing about football, Doodles. Oh. I mean, I've, I've watched it during the Super Bowl. I don't give a shit about Tom Brady, man. The dude was friends with Donald Trump. You think I give a shit? Oh, God, was he? Yeah, he was a huge Donald Trump fan. Yeah. All right, let me... I got to backtrack on this video real quick, guys. Hold on. Who's the asshole that, um... Oh, I didn't do that. Oh, shit. Hold on, doodles. I'm trying to pay attention. Okay. Oh, fuck. I missed that. What? What asshole? Tim Tebow. I was trying to think of Tim Tebow. The yep. asshole that, that prayed after getting a touchdown and then got plastered all over every Chick-fil-A cup ever. Sure. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> I have no idea who these people are. Help me. Damn it! I already got lost. I must... Oh, you know what? This is it. This is it. Then they went up here. Okay. Okay, I was already up here, but I'm just trying to follow the video. Chat, I can't see you because I'm paying attention to this very important video which will it's okay chat i see you and i hear you i know you've been ignored for so long <laughs> shut up don't be nice to them but i'm here for you i'm not <laughs> <laughs> got him okay i'm making progress this is good oh this is a place i haven't been yet okay pausing Chat, I can see you again. Hello, chat. I just barely made that. This is so fucking convoluted. I hate this goddamn planet. Okay, this is definitely a place I haven't been yet. Look at this, chat. There's trees. Trees everywhere. Trees? What the hell kind of place is this? I don't know what's that, what that's from, but Probably just sunny. by the, the, the annotation, I'm going to say sunny. Yeah, it's sunny. It's Charlie. Yeah, that is going to be my guess. Trees everywhere, trees! What the hell kind of place is this? Um, oh, oh, chat! Did I do it? I did it! Woo! I made it! Hooray! I've done it! And I didn't cheat! <laughs> yeah? And I didn't look up how to get here. Okay, we already read that one. Let me guess, this is a door that goes to the outside. What is that? Of course it is. What is what? You didn't hear that? Yeah, that was probably Grim's microphone. Yeah. It wasn't that loud. Oh, well, it was loud for me. I'm here. I did it. I put the ship down safely. Um, In the ship that went down, and I didn't sustain bodily harm, a few minor repairs, and it's like the ship has never been hit by those rocks. One of my better attempts. 
feldspar would barely have laughed at me, I bet. That's the good news. The bad news, I uh, haven't found a way inside the structure yet. The door's broken, and I know I'm not great at exploring, but I think I would have found a different entrance by now if there were one. Probably. I can't get inside from here, but I know there are paths down below the surface. I'm gonna head north to the ruins and the equator and try to find a way down. Okay. So I guess I never found this. Where is this? Is that my ship? Oh, that's... Oh, it's right outside of the fucking observatory. Okay. And the door was locked. Okay. Door locked. Door stuck. Door stuck. Door stuck. Cassava's construction yard has been using the cyclones on Giant's Deep to lift the orbital probe cannon parts into orbit. But one component was pushed down past the current that usually prevents anything from sinking. Spire and I are crafting a model to determine why this happened. An update. It's now clear there are different types of cyclone. This is all sequence break. We all we already did all this shit. Uh, there also exists a rare type of cyclone that spins in the opposite direction and pushes objects beneath the waters and below the current. My gratitude, Spire. Conoy is showing me your handiwork, and I'm intrigued by this secondary type of cyclone. But was it really necessary to build a model to tell me that? The model will be useful as we continue monitoring Giant's Deep. Also, I very much wanted to make a model. Okay, so that's if you don't know what's going on in Giant's Deep. I see. All that work, and it was for stuff we already knew. R.I.P. Oh, there's stuff up there. Ah! Wait, there's more. Hold on, I didn't read those. Most cyclones on Giant's Deep rotate clockwise. Yeah, okay. I see. Alright, I see. See more? Yes. Can I see? No. Remember that, guys? Remember steamed hams? I do. I do remember steamed hams. What have we learned thus far in our search for the eye of the universe? Those of us on the vessel originally followed the eye signal to the star system, but we were unable to warp to the eye itself. The locator we built on the outer rock and the new, more sensitive locator we built here were both unable to detect any trace of the eye signal. Hypothesis, the eye stopped emitting its signal. Suppose the eye doesn't wish to be found. Sava, how can you suggest that? The eye signal called out to summon us to the star system. I'm aware. I grew up hearing the eye's story. Yet we're no closer to finding it than we were when you first arrived here. Based on our knowledge of the quantum moon, we believe the eye is in orbit around this star system's sun. This would mean the eye is located within a finite, albeit enormous, range. Oh, Steam Tams was pretty funny. Steam Tams is funny. It, I think it's still kind of funny. Right, let's see what. Oh, there's something over here. Yeah, bud? Yeah, I do! I think Steam Tams is funny! How should our methods change as we continue our search for the Eye of the Universe? We know that the Eye looks like we know what the eye looks like thanks to the quantum moon, so what if we try to find the eye visually instead? Send out a probe. We need to build a probe launching mechanism to cover those long distances quickly. A cannon in orbit around a celestial body would circumvent the need to escape the gravity's pull. Aurora Borealis, localized entirely within your kitchen. Yes. Can I see it? No. No. Well, Seawar, you're an odd fellow. But I must say, you steam a good hand. Help! Help! The house is on fire! Giants. No, mother. No, mother. It's just, just the northern lights. <laughs> Giants deep would be a good choice. It's furthest for the sun, so it would be provided to the best angles for launch. And it's moonless, except when the quantum moon is visiting. Yes, let's build the cannon in orbit around Giant's Deep. 
Since we couldn't find the eye's signal using two different devices built for this exact purpose, we should discontinue this search method. Help! Help! And he does the thumbs up and the smile. Mallow's idea is clever, but we have no idea where the eye is in relation to here. The probability of launching a probe in the correct direction would be absurdly small. I wonder if I could quote all of Steamed Hams from memory. I bet you could. I believe I have I a solution. I bet you could, too. Yeah. I believe I have a solution for that problem. Have you spoken with Remy and Pi about the technology they're developing? Bray, look! We made it! Nice. And I didn't cheat. Just kidding. <laughs> the way getting here was fucking impossible. thought that was Quantum Moon for a second. That's Giant Steep, isn't it? Uh, let's see. I think this just brings up uh, big planet simulations. It does. Oh, does. oh, it shows their orbit. That's cool. Oh, you can activate all of them. Whoa. What's that one? Oh, that's a... Uh... That's, uh, the thorny one. What's its name? Dark Bramble. Dark Bramble, thank you. And there's the eye, and oh my god. <gasps> Whoa. The eye is kind of in a never-changing position. Ah. Also, there's more to read since you popped that one up. One of those little things mm. came up by it. All right. Unable to determine orbit, no signal detected may match any known criteria for the eye of the universe. So this was their original method of scanning for it, and it didn't work, and then they decided to build the probe. I see. What's with the gritty Military 2000s shooter music? This isn't- what? The music in this game is beautiful, but make fun of it. Well, we did it, guys! Hopefully, that's all we had to explore on this fucking planet. God, I hope so. I'm sick of Brittle Hollow. And I'm sick of Brit. No response. No response. The I'm Brit trying to start eating. Oh. Oh, you got your food! Yeah, like I said, it's literally a minute away car ride. Oh, okay. It's in the same parking lot as my mom's work, not even a block away. Oh, okay. Well, that's nice. Uh, let's see if I can quote Steamed Hams from memory. I haven't seen it in probably about three years, if they remember that. Uh, okay, so. Skinner walks up to the door. No. Chalmers walks up to the door. Ding dong. Well, Seymour? Uh, fuck! You guys are gonna have to help me. Seymour, I made it. Despite hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, Seymour, I made it despite your directions. Ah, oh, Superintendent Chalmers, welcome. I hope you're ready for an unforgettable luncheon. Ah. <gasps> oh, my roast! It's ruined. Hmm. Uh. Fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. And then he's, then uh... Then he looks through the door and he, he sees well, he looks, Krusty Burger. He looks through the window and he sees Krusty Burger. He's like, uh, it, uh, my roast is ruined. Unless. And then he starts climbing at the window and Chalmers comes in and goes, ah! That's the beginning to the nanny theme song! <laughs> Shit! I don't remember the song that plays. Fuck. Ah, Superintendent Chalmers. I'm uh, just stretching my legs on the windowsill. Care to join me? Why is there smoke coming from your oven, Seymour? Uh, that's not smoke. It's steam. Steam from the steamed hams we're having. Mmm. Ste oh, steamed, steamed clams. clams. Yeah. Mmm, steamed clams. Squeak of door. Leaves the kitchen. Phew. He runs over to Krusty Burger. 
and uh, we cut back to the kitchen. Well, uh, Superintendent Chalmers, I hope you're ready for an unforgettable luncheon. No, he already said that. Oh, I hope you're ready for some steamed hams. I thought we were having steamed clams. No, no, I said steamed hams. That's what I call hamburgers. You call hamburgers steamed hams? Yes. Uh, it's a... Ah, oh, fuck, what's the town? It's a... Albany. Al it's an Albany expression. Well, I'm from Utica, and I've never heard that expression. No, that's what it is. It's it's a uh, upstate New York. And then he goes, uh, it, oh, I'm from Utica, and I've never heard that expression. He goes, oh, uh, it's an Albany expression. Ah, I see. And then they start chewing it. Well, Seymour, this is very good, despite the fact that they are quite clearly grilled. You fucked up already. Yeah, I've been fucking up the whole time. They, they, I don't even want to read it anymore, Merm. Just kidding. Read it. I said read it like I wasn't fucking remembering it. Uh, fuck. Uh... Is it quite good, despite the fact... You say they're steamed, despite the fact that they're quite obviously grilled. Uh, it, uh, hold on one second. Yes, of course. Then he goes into the kitchen. At some point he sees the fire, and I don't remember when. <laughs> Good lord, what is happening in then, there? No, 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 hold on. He goes in and he's like, Oh, well, I'm, I'm pooped. Uh, time to hit the hay. Yes, well, I suppose. Good god, what is happening in there? Aurora Borealis. Uh, Aurora Borealis. And this year, at this time of day, localized entirely within your kitchen. Yes. May I see it? No. No. <laughs> it, uh, Seymour, the house is on fire! No, Mother, those are just the northern lights. Well, Seymour, you're an odd fellow. But I must say, you steam a good ham. Help! Help! <laughs> Thumbs up as he walks away. Split second of fire <laughs> engine. <laughs> there you go. That's it. I kind of... I remember the basics, okay? I don't remember it perfectly, but you know what? I think I remembered a good chunk of it. Okay, so we did... You almost got there. I remember... I, like I said, I haven't seen it in like three years. Holy shit, we still have to find the Ash Twin Project. We haven't been to Ember Twin like at all. We should probably go back to... Uh, Bramble, right? Yeah, because we need to see the vessel, and we need to find the escape uh, pod that couldn't make it. Yeah, right. And then there's still the quantum shard on Timber Hearth. Oh, yeah. Where is that? We'll look for that next loop, since we'll wake up there anyways. Okay. I don't know how much time we have left. I don't think I wasted much time doing that, so... You didn't, you didn't set the timer again? No, I forgot. Plus, I paused it to read steamed hams. Read. I keep saying read. I paused it to remember steamed hams. Britt, do you remember how many edits of those? Oh, there's the quantum moon. It's funny how easily we can find it when we're not looking for it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, do you remember how many edits there were of that? I liked the one where there were several uh, computer screens and then they were all synced up just to the moment where they say steamed hams, but they were all totally varying speeds. Yes. I think that one was my favorite. No, uh, my favorite was the one that made it uh, go along to All-Star. <laughs> Same R. What is that there? It, yeah. Uh, there are a lot of stars still in the sky. The feel-good ink one! Steamed hams, dirt. <laughs> that might be my favorite. I figured your favorite would be the one where it switches animators every five seconds, and then it's that's... the five seconds of um, <laughs> that's pretty... um uh, of Spike Spiegel. Oh, Spike Spiegel is uh 
<laughs> yeah, Skinner. Oh! Oh, they're gonna, the fish are gonna love me! <laughs> easy food, easy food for them. Plus, I'm just gonna go in and it's gonna be like, BIP! Fish love you, women fear you. Fish fear me, women fear me. Did I die? <laughs> Brit! Brit! <laughs> Did you get inside and explode? No, I don't know what's I think your ship died and you're still alive oh, there. Oh no, the ship... <laughs> the ship did die. It's out of... it broke. What's that? What is that? Good what? lord, what is going on in there? Brent, what is that? See that? If I had to guess, I'd say part of your ship. Oh. <laughs> oh no. Oh no! <laughs> there it goes. <laughs> I didn't realize it was just in the cockpit. Will they kill me? Yeah, you're almost out of fuel, so... Oh, man, you're right. Don't worry, I'll just fuel up. <laughs> Chad, I'll just fuel up, it's fine. <sighs> I can fly this thing without a cockpit, right? Sure. Let me in. Are you gonna try and... <laughs> You're gonna try and fix that. Yeah. I gotta go get the cockpit and bring it over here. But I think... I think we'll be alright. Uh-oh. Oh no. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> it was going so well. And then I hit every entrance of the Dark Bribble at once and my ship exploded. I can't believe I didn't realize my ship split in half. I was just This is how the Dark Bramble be. Just like the Titanic. <laughs> what? Because the ship split in half? Yeah. Just like the Titanic. Except it's far less death. Death and far less oh. fish, I think, well, too. And far less every, Kate Winslet. Well, Brit, if you think about it, far more death. One out of one person died. Yeah, that's a 100% mortality yeah, That's a 100% fatality Okay, <laughs> okay you got me. <laughs> At least in Titanic, Rose lived, except that movie was completely fictional. Um, all you right. know who did live? The unsinkable Molly Brown. Who? The unsinkable Molly Brown? I don't, I don't know who that is. Well, her name was Molly Brown, and she was a lot of ships that sank, including the Titanic. And she survived every single time. What? You, you'd think after the first couple, she'd stop getting on ships. This is not a real person. Yes! I've been to her house! It's a museum in Missouri. You met her? No. <laughs> I did jam my finger in her door, though. <laughs> That's all I remember from the museum was jamming my finger really hard. Um, okay, where is this rock? Eh. Oh, thanks. I would guess somewhere in the geysers. Quantum signal. The Nomad detected a quantum signal coming from somewhere on Timber Hearth. The problem is I can't search for that signal because it's constantly moving. No! The Black Hole Forge! Black Hole Forge, won't you come? Wash away the rain. What do you mean? Like, you can get into the black hole forge from underneath, not on top. But we'll come back to that later. Uh, Brittle Hollow is 99% done. I don't want to go back. And you're getting mad at it, so let's just count that off the table for now. Stop singing. Sorry. 
It's been stuck in my head this entire time. Does Mortar explore in the probe tracking module? Because you didn't read everything down there because you had lim limited time. No, this so is... So I just had you get... No, in the probe. The probe tracking module, part of it is the core of... Oh, that's right. Okay. Okay, we have to try to find this rock. Ow. Motherfucker dies on Twin Hearth. Saddest story ever. Twin Hearth. Yep, that's a new planet I just invented. Okay. Anybody seen a rock? Oh, there's something. Oh. Well. <laughs> Rejected. Well. Please let me in. Ow. New area has been loaded. Okay, so we've been here before, right? To, I don't think in this cave specifically. Oh, okay. Because look at all the stuff the Harthians have just chucked down the geyser and lost. <laughs> I see that. Whoa. Well, I can't go down there. I'm not sure if there's anything I can do down here. Oh, there's another tunnel. Whoa! Just like Universal Studios. Oh, fuck, you have to time it correctly. Well, I suppose I could just go back down there, huh? I think that's one of the first two you actually went down that one time. <laughs> Now where the fuck are we? Maybe try going up this geyser. Well, let me see if there's anything else here. Whoa. Oh, it's Feldspar. I came from there. Yeah, you're probably right. Probably have to go here. Whoa! What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> oh, wait, what's this? Oh, there's another hole. Oh. I bet. And this is the one with the Nomai writing we've yeah. read before. Whoa! Yeah. Yeah, I went here. But, like, where the fuck's that rock? Might be in the Nomai building here. Worst astronaut ever. Can you imagine being a Harthi and just, like, watching the geysers? And the hatchling's first day of flight, he's not on the <laughs> ship. He goes shooting out of the geyser and dies. He's like, I'll be back. And for the next 22 minutes, they're freaking out. <laughs> that was the shortest loading time ever, because it only had to teleport me 10 feet. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm going to be back. Okay. My yep. turn for food. What? It's my turn for food. Doodle's turn for food. Yeah. Why? Why? Now look <laughs> no, I mean, I know what's going to happen when I look away. But, like, why? It's like, it's it, we, we spent, like, what, ten minutes trying to find the thing last time? <laughs> and now it's like, here I am! Bye! And it's like, ooh, And it's gone.
Okay, so there's like a cave system down here. Isn't there? No, like a cave uh, There is actually the zero, uh, zero G cave that you were supposed to check yeah, this out. this one, right? Uh, oh. no, not this one. Oh. It's up... It's upstairs. Oh! Is that... Yeah, that's it again. <laughs> really likes Timber Hearts inside. The fucking quantum moon! That son of a bitch! Brittany. Brittany, quantum the worst quantum stream crunch. food. The worst stream food. What are you doing? Eating crab ragoons. Oh my goodness. Where is this zero G thing? Um, I believe it's on the other side of your little cannon. Canyon. Oh. oh. I will take the ship. You don't need to take the ship. Oh well. It's in here with you. Over here? No. Oh. Dude, Canyon, just like Red versus Blue. Wow. The minute I said it, I was thinking about why are we out here in this canyon. So many references to Red versus Blue in this game. Right there, I believe. Oh. You are parking above it. It's up. There's nice music playing for it. It's nice. Yeah. It's nice music. Despite the fact that I will die. Where? You're actually going the right way, yes. I'm not lying you to you, there's... No, I know. Where is yeah. it? Right there. Wait. Oh, that's... That's a Sorry, rock. Sorry, I thought that rock... Okay, go down, there's signposts. Uh, up against the walk, the rock wall. Zero G cave, now follow it. give you directions i'm getting you to the thing that can i'm just kidding what is this who is this who are you oh it's gossam you're back awfully soon everything all right slate didn't do anything dumb like install a self-destruct button did they anybody seen a rock whoa that's cool. Are we going to the center of the planet? Most likely, yeah. Oh, that's neat. Whoa. There's no gravity down here. Whoa. Or very little of it. Cool. Where the rock? Whoa. Gossam, where the rock at? Gossam! Fuck this, I'm flying up to him. There's a doorway in the wall over there, Ryan. Fuck. There was? Yeah. Fuck! God damn it! You were to like two, a second too late. It's because I had to put my microphone down to, to tell you because I'm eating. Okay, bye, Gossin. <laughs> oh, dude. That looks like shit. This game's bad. This game's bad, Britt. Look at this. Britt, look at this. Britt? Go into the hole in the wall. Britt, this game's bad. Look. Go into the hole in the wall. It doesn't even look real. Actually, come to, the think hole in the wall. come to think of it, none of this game looks real. This looks like a video game, Britt. Oh, look. I'm already wearing one of those. <laughs> Stinky texture game bad. <laughs> I like oh, wow. describing it as stinky. This game is this game is uh I was gonna say this game is bad. No, this cave is big is what I was gonna say. So maybe we will run into the rock down here. 
What is that? Whoa! This is uh, where you were supposed to learn how to fix That's stuff in zero gravity if your ship exploded in space. <laughs> it's training. I don't need fucking training. I'm the Quite legend. literally, it's a tutorial that you skipped. Is the rock down here? It might be. I don't know. Oh, Britt doesn't know. The what good are you? <laughs> Fuck this tutorial. No, it isn't, Nat says. Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> Back to hell I go! I'm going to eat one of these teriyaki jerky bites because I'm angry. Yo, I heard those were uh, John Fuser's favorite. <laughs> Who? <laughs> He's a DJ. I don't listen to that shit. <sighs> I fucked up the lights again. All right, where the fuck is that rock? I imagine it's got to be somewhere on the surface. The problem is it's quantum. So the stupid thing's always moving. Oh, duh. What? <laughs> Go to the museum. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, it's there? What is? The fucking quantum rock. It's in the, <laughs> God, it's in the fucking museum. Of course it is. Well, you made a joke about it the first time we played. Why oh, did it just back come back to me? Oh. Oh, my God. That rock? <laughs> I never fucking inspected it with the signal scope. Oh, you didn't know what it was at that point. Oh, for fuck's sake. God. Oh my god. It's like Together we have the IQ of a banana. Oh my god. That was ten minutes into the first stream. Sounds like you guys are having fun. I fucking god damn it. I'm back from space! I think this is the first time I've ever landed back at the fucking landing port. Uh, I didn't even... You don't have your suit on, yeah, don't jump. I know. Okay, I guess we'll go inspect that fucking rock. We have banana intelligence. Alright, we inspect the rock. Oh. Hey. Hey, They're look at this. We're probably going to talk about how it looks. Oh, the statue opened its eyes. Bet you wish you could see that happen, huh? Me too. I'm not even a little close to understanding what's going on with this statue. I found Feldspar. I found Feldspar? Is a dark bramble? Stars above, this is wonderful news. Thank you. Thank you for finding them. That Feldspar didn't immediately join you on your ship and return here is incredibly Feldspar of them. <laughs> okay. We never, we were really Feldspar never sure intro. what Feldspar was thinking back then either. Still, we ought to fish them out of that dreadful place with all the haste. I'll radio Gossin and have them prepare a ship. It really should be Gossin who brings Feldspar home. Again, thank you. I can hardly imagine how profoundly happy I am to hear they're alive and unharmed. Hey. You just tell them you found Feldspar again. I was just about to come find you. Look, look, look. You gotta see this. The you know, my statue's eyes are open. They used to be closed. Probably should have started with that. And now they're open! We're not sure why they're open, since no one actually saw it happen, but this is huge news. 
oh yeah, you're the only you only saw this happen on one loop. And now it's just kind of open forever. Right. Should someone tell Gabbro? Maybe Rybeck? Oh, stars, this is exciting. I think my stomach hurt. How? Can you help me translate this new English language I found? Oh, I see. A new language? Yes, absolutely. Stars above. You bet I can. Just give me, let's call it 100 samples, some form of epigraphical codex, in six months. And I should have a vague gist of some sort of uh, graphemes this new language is working with. Can't wait to get started. Oh, fuck. Six months. Yeah, uh, how about 22 minutes? How about 22 minutes? Hey, look! A fucking rock! Unidentified signal nearby. Motherfucker! <laughs> God damn it. I am so fucking mad. It was right fucking... We were joking about that rock. Ten minutes into the first fucking street. <laughs> So now we gotta find the one on the on Ember Twin. Oh, there's one on Ember Twin. The one on Ember Twin is actually kind of vital to solving a puzzle on Ember Twin. Ember Twin's the one place we haven't really explored yet. Uh, isn't Huey Lewis in the new Six People? I think so. Maybe six. Maybe more. Imagine. Um, okay. Six Huey Lewis's? <laughs> yes. Die! Um, that's it. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> it was a fetch fits. Otherwise, yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Um. I guess we'll try to go to the Black Hole Forge, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, fuck okay. it. It should be. Yeah, it should. No, it should be Huey Lewis. No, it should. I think it would be less horrifying if it were Huey Lewis's face over Precure. Like Huey Lewis over Cure Whip. This is profoundly stupid. What am I doing? You're worst. Oh my god. Why? Shouldn't I have learned? Never mind. Never doubt me. Well, you know you're gonna <laughs> lose your ship here in about maybe five minutes. That's fine. I don't need it. Never doubt me. Huey Lewis and their third brother, the news. <laughs> oh, that was the wrong way. What happened to Dewey? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, that goes the bridge. Why did I just remember the the Cards Against Humanity pack? Nom. Part? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> the the Cards Against Humanity pack we had, where one of the cards was uh, Huey Lucas in the Ness. <laughs> I don't remember that card. All right, pretty good. I also don't remember it, but it's pretty good. <laughs> I remember Ryan's dumb horn hat. Mean. I remember Boop made no, that me was make him a I know dad. it was, but it was a mean card. I remember Boop's card pack that he made me make with white, uh, 50 white cards that all said Bill Murray. Hey, are you guys aware that despite the fact that uh, this new chat viewership was built on Homestuck, uh, that was, <laughs> I wasn't even wearing the horn hat anymore. <laughs> yeah. I, the white hole, the black hole forge button was on the one you just came from. Why would I need to press it? Can I just hop down? I don't think so. I think it's easier. I don't know how to get into it from up there, Brit. Okay, jump into it now and we'll try on this side. Okay. Do you still have the horn hat? Yeah, of course. 
I thought maybe you would have burned it. Well. I didn't see a hole to get into it. Okay, next time bring it up and maybe there is a hole on the underside that you can come into that isn't going into the black hole. Hole! Hole! Fuck! I forgot to tell you, uh, I, I was watching an old, uh, VOD from Scorpy. It was a VR, uh, mummy game, which was clearly a ripoff of Phasmophobia. Like, a <laughs> like a hundred percent a ripoff of Phasmophobia. I thought you, you, when you said mummy, I thought you meant, like, a, a video game adaption of the hit movie. I think it was, movie. I, I don't, I don't know. It could have been, to be honest. I, I didn't With really look. Brendan Fraser. Yeah, I didn't really look into it, but, um, either way, I, what I thought was interesting is that in that game, when you die, you can choose to come back as a helpful spirit who can, uh, like, help you find collectibles and stuff to help complete it even though you're dead. I like yeah. the option of choice. Uh, well, the other choice. <laughs> yes. Please the, tell me it's a vengeful spirit It's who a wants vengeful to kill mummy. You can come back as a vengeful mummy to kill your friends. Um, that is what Phasmophobia is. Yeah, like. it really way, is. Have you seen? Have you seen some of the new updates for Phasmophobia? No, we gotta are, we gotta play Phasmophobia. There are tarot cards. There what? are voodoo dolls. Oh, what? There's there's two specific ghosts that I really want to check out. There's one that's called the Twins, and then there's one there's one oh. that's called the Mimic. Oh, we need to play Phasmophobia. The Twins, uh, two ghost rooms. Only one of them's a true ghost room. Uh, they will show options in both. Alternate hunts from the two separate rooms, so you never know where it's coming from. And then the mimic will pretend to be all other ghost types oh, and has sucks. a full and has. It's not part of their clues, but will always have ghost orbs. Oh wow! So the mimic has four clues instead of three. Oh, I forgot to tell you, the ventral mummy in that ripoff game, uh, it it changes your in-game voice. Oh my god! To be deep and like demonic and scary. Unfortun nice. Unfortunately, most of the time, the person who died was Scorpy, so I didn't get to hear it. But all no, you could also no, you go first. So all you could hear was Wayne's reaction to it, which was screaming and laughing. <laughs> also, there's an outdoor site, which is a campground. There are oh. weather phenomenon now. Oh. So it could be uh, cold. It could be snowy, so it's going to be colder by default. There's so much added. Yeah, that sounds crazy. I don't think you've seen uh, an obake, obake. Oh, I don't know, man. I don't know Japanese. Uh, six, it's a six, Japanese word. Yeah, no yeah. shit. I don't know Japanese. Six-fingered handprints. Oh my god. Well, you know, well, you know, needs well, you know what that means. Yeah. That means the man who killed my father is is in the game. <laughs> there is uh, a raiju. He killed Montoya. The six-fingered man. Yeah, the mimic can mimic the abilities and traits of all other ghost types and will present ghost orbs as uh -oh. a secondary evidence. Uh -oh. Either twin may start a hunt, though not at the uh, same time. That was bullshit! <laughs> and both of the twins will often interact with the environment at the same time, so if you I'm are not listening one, anymore, Brit. I know you're not. Brittle Hollow fucking sucks, dude. <laughs> I keep think I keep thinking you're saying Brit Hala. Remember when that was a thing? Chat doesn't. That was also a card. Chat doesn't. We can't make references to old things because chat won't get it. This hey, is remember Jam? 
Our good friend Jam. Well, Jam got married. Jam's getting married. Yeah. Well, I mean, Jam, first of all, Jam has a kid now. Jam came into chat the other day. Well, not the other day, like um, a couple couple weeks ago. Because I was playing Metal Gear, and I mentioned Jam, and I guess Boop went and talked to Jam and said I mentioned him, and then Jam showed up. I'm going to uh, go put the rest of my food up. I will be right back. Fine. Remember... Stop bringing up old things! This shit happened like eight Looks like years ago. I can't remember shit. This stuff happened like eight years ago, okay? It was a long time ago. I really don't want to go back to fucking Brittle Hollow, so you know what? We're not going to. There's a fucking quantum moon again. Son of a bitch. Oh, I hope I don't look bad. Oh my god, it's gone! I'm back. I saw the quantum moon the minute I took off. <laughs> hate that fucking thing. Alright. I'm going to the bramble. Okay, try and follow the red light this time. Okay. Hope you guys are ready for a slow, slow adventure through Dark Bramble. Or actually, you could take out the signal scope and you can try listening for the escape pod symbol. Signal. Oh, yeah, that's true. Because that'll take you to the escape pod, and from the escape pod, I think you can get to the, uh... To the vessel faster. Oh, I had too much of this jerky. I'm putting it away. Too much teriyaki jerky. No such thing. Ugh. I like jerky, but I can't have too much of it. Especially since it's like half pound bags. That is a lot. Alright, let's see. That's Feldspar. Uh, I'm not picking it up, Britt. You might need to go through. Yeah, I think I might. Oh, oh wait, boy. go down. Oh boy, I'm not going anywhere, Brett. No, I mean like turn down. Because it goes closer. No, that's Feldspar, Britt. That's Feldspar again? Right. Okay. Yeah, just head towards the red light. Oh, I'm, I'm just gonna coast. I'm good. Just head towards the light, Ryan. I'm not in any fucking rush. Oh, I'm gonna fly into this thing, aren't I? I'm gonna hit it. I don't think so. It's beautiful. Saturn Rowit says, why would Roxanne do this? Roxanne. You don't have to put out the red light. Oh, guys, I started building a better Spotify playlist. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. <laughs> Damn it. Yeah, that's not going to work. <laughs> I wasn't moving anymore. Then don't gun it. Hit it a little bit. <laughs> no. As Jeremy Clarkson would say, more power. You are never going to beat this game. <laughs> Brit, I've made so much progress. I'm nearly halfway done. Yeah, you asked me a question that was like three more streams at this rate. Probably five. No, no, no. It's not five, Brit. I can beat the game now. I could go and beat it now. Is that not correct? I mean, if you want to try and beat it when you get to the vessel. I mean, you, you just don't want me to beat it because of lore. You want me to steal the lore. I could just... I could have beaten the game first stream. I could have skipped all the lore. Okay, do you know how to get into the middle of the Ash Twin Project? The what? What the fuck's the Ashman project? <laughs> Anyways, let's go back to Dark Bramble. Because you've got the right idea, you're just missing a step. Also, yes, Britt, I do. It's called Google. <laughs> he doesn't know about the Ashton project. It was founded by William Ashton, the the man behind the slaughter. <laughs> it's Ashton. Oh, whatever. Who the fuck cares? Yeah, Ashton. The, the worst part is, is I knew you were going there. Chad, I have bad news. I know a small amount of Five Nights at Freddy's lore now. 
Because Despite everything, I'm still kind that, of. Let me. Okay, in let's talk. Let's talk about this for a second. I'd like to point out. All right, Five Nights at Freddy's. Right, came out mm -hmm. when? Came out when? 2014. 20. No, that can't be. 2012, probably. I'm googling it. Okay, the first Five Nights mm -hmm. at Freddy's. Came 2014. Out, okay, came out 2014. Uh, game sucked. Horrible, horrible, fucking terrible <laughs> game. It's just a jump scare simulator. And that's all they made for years and years and years. And now, finally, they made Security Breach. And I watch footage. It looks good. It looks like an actual fucking game. And all I hear from fucking FNAF fans are, oh, this is the end of but the it's series. Not this a game. Real Shut up! Five Shut up! Game Shut up! Game. Shut up! <laughs> it's the first game that actually looks like a goddamn fucking game. And people are like, this is the end of FNAF. This is it. It's down the tubes. It looks good. It was also <laughs> very, very glitchy. Who gives a shit? It's a game. The uh, The first 12 were not games. It was just garbage simulator. And you know what? They outsourced this new one to a completely different company. And you know what? They did pretty good. I don't care if the game's glitchy. At least it's a fucking video game. That's all I'm saying. I dislike the robots and the ghosts. I cannot enter this fucking... <laughs> They're really gonna love you. Whatever. Floor it. You fly into one, you explode and kill it. <laughs> and then you're stranded in the dark bramble uh, with no ship. Uh... My point is, I always hated Five Nights at Freddy's, and they finally made a game where I was like, ah! What? <laughs> oh, I exploded! <laughs> I didn't realize I had a reactor breach. Why do you say- why do you think I said you're gonna floor it and get I inside of- were, I thought you were- I thought you were kidding! That's the only time that alarm will be going off, is if your reactor is oh, damaged. Oh, okay. Then why didn't it kill me that last time? I don't know. I think it's because I was loading. Brett likes sister location. I did like sister location. I liked a lot of them. Not like gameplay wise, and I, I can go back and watch gameplay now and nothing scares me anymore, but... I mean, how do you even grasp any... Uh, isn't the plot all in the novels? No, not all of it. Time. Yeah, it's a totally different thing. It's wild that you can have plot in a game where you're literally just closing doors. That's wild to me. Going back and rereading some of the plot stuff that they've added back, like retrospective for the past games, too, which was really funny to me. <laughs> I'm going to the Ember Twin. It's essentially one family and their screwed up dad. They're very screwed up dad. Their Dude, screwed up dad who really, really, really likes to kill children and really doesn't want to die. Speaking of screwed up dads who really, really likes to harm children, I was thinking of the Umbrella Academy today. <laughs> and I was like, oh shit, I hope they do a season three soon because I'm missing Umbrella Academy. <laughs> fucking hate that dude. That dude sucks so bad. You know, Umbrella Academy might have its flaws, but that show is kind of good. What Merm said. It's kind of good. Uh, Scott Cawthorn's a hack and doesn't know how to write story. Yeah. Yeah, that's why I, I for the mean, first, like, five games, you have to piece it together yourself, and it was all majorly theories. Huge Republican, that guy, from what I hear. Yeah. Uh, put a bunch of the FNAF money into Republican <laughs> parties, which is, uh, frightening. That's why I- Frightening, that's to why, say the least, since he used That's it. why I say, despite everything, I still, unfortunately, kind of like it. He literally- he literally took a bunch of money from kids and used it to fund the Republican Party. That's terrifying. Uh, 
Umbrella Academy problem number one, Aiden Gallagher. Who? Gallagher? Isn't that the guy from Shameless? <laughs> Gallagher? Isn't that the watermelon guy? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's why I don't give him my money. I watch people play the game and I go read read read, a, read Wikipedia articles about how his story is supposed Five's to go. Five's actor. What's what's wrong with Five's actor? Is he cringe now? Is he is he uh canceled? Also Republican. Ah. Ooh. I see. Okay. What am I doing here? What am I this I'm in a part I wasn't def before. Uh, you're in the place that will start being... The, su the Sunless... Yeah, you're supposed to be trying to find the Sunless City. I thought this was the Sunless Path to the Sunless City. The Sunless City is under the underground. Uh, that makes you should sense. be able to get into it through Have I this, I this believe. Have been to escape yet? I think you've been to it, but you haven't, like, in it, possibly. Ow. What does this door do? Nothing. Hmm. Well, ah, entrance. I see. Ah, I see. See more. <laughs> Fuck. We can't. We can't do this again. <coughs> okay. Here's a new part we haven't been to. That's not the right thing. Fill your air supply tank and return quickly. Oh, okay. So this is like a dead end. Yeah, this is a dead end. Uh, by the way, guys, uh, Knox did finish the 2021 uh, Best Of video. And I'm going to upload it. And I will set it to a premiere. And we will watch it uh, tomorrow on YouTube. Nice. Cool. Uh, the Knox finished the premiere video. Uh, the, uh, the, uh, best of 2021 video. How do I get in there? That's the part, I think, with the quantum rock. This planet... That I was thinking of. This planet is very confusing, Britt. It's very confusing, and you're on a secondary time limit. Well, yeah, I know that. No, you don't see me, Mr. Lionel. Why you not? don't see me, Mr. Sir. The, the guy Lionel. who made the toy bank? Lionel what? Toy Bank. Lionel Toy Bank, Lionel Toy Bank, Lionel Toy Bank. <laughs> I genuinely don't know what you're referring to. How? It was a big, it was a big, uh... A I'm big, Googling Lionel Toy Bank. It was a big bank. You could put your money in it, and it was like train-themed... It was called Lionel Toy Bank, and the the commercial was Lionel Toy Bank, Lionel Toy Bank, Lionel Toy Bank, Lionel. Toy Bank. You know, this is starting to sound vaguely familiar. <laughs> Why have we I, never I, talked I, about this? I said I sent a link to it, Doodles. Why have we never? I need to play this on stream. Oh. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I remember, I remember, I remember, I remember. Okay, we need to play this on stream because Lionel <laughs> Toy Bank. <laughs> I know coin bank. I know coin bank. The 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 option under that Here was go, Lionel chat. coin bank nightmare. Here we go. Chat. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, chat. Here we go. Here is a collectible bank sure to warm the hearts of everyone who loves trains. Lionel coin bank. Lionel coin bank. It's the Lionel train crossing bank. Just insert any coin, and the signal lights flash, the engines turn, you even hear that nostalgic whistle blow. And it's a genuine <laughs> Lionel collectible, an amazing gift for everyone who loves trains large and small, and perfect for anyone wanting a fun way to save that change. You even get to watch Lionel your savings Coinbase, grow. Lionel trains harken back to a simpler time. No joke, until right now I thought it was Lionel Toy Bank the whole a time. time. of limitless possibilities. We'll celebrate those times with the Lionel, with the Lionel train can't crossing anymore. Bank. Go back to it bed. Saving those coins a lot more fun. Save your money. Save your money. <laughs> save your money. Save your money. Save your money. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> I 
I should have linked you this one instead. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? It's gotta be here. Where is it? Someone's gotta be selling it. <clears throat> Damn it. Beep, beep. Here Sorry. you guys can have this link too. Where's the Lino coin bank? I need it. What the fuck? How much money is it? No, I just... Not that I, much. I typed in Lino coin bank and then <laughs> this is the first result. Five Nights at Freddy's decorative coin bank. <laughs> no. Fetty. What's it shaped like? Fetty. It's shaped like Fetty. Where is that Five Freddy's at Night image? It's shaped like Fetty. <laughs> Oh, I really. Oh, there's like a Pikachu one. Where's this Lino toy bank? I can't find it. Did anyone find one? Doodles, did you find one? No. I thought you said you did. No, I got confused. Oh, damn it. I don't think it, nobody's yeah. selling them. Maybe nobody bought any. Maybe. Save your money. Save your money. Save your money. I don't know where I'm going, but. Sounds like you need the Someone line there pretty back. Fast. What is that? What is this? This is a dead end. I think that was part of a path. So, too late now? Yeah. It, it hasn't even been that long into the loop. Oh my god. Oh my god, Ralph found one. Oh, there's something here. Oh, good. Excellent. Yeah, how much is it? Oh. How much is it? <laughs> oh, it's a knockoff. Oh, it's a knockoff. But it's the closest way I think yeah, we can do Yeah, but I want a legit... Oh god, scroll down and see the woman who's selling it. Ugh. No thanks. Ah. Uh. Ugh. <laughs> She's horrifying. She looks like a witch. I was gonna say she unfortunately looks like JK Rowling. Yeah. <laughs> Same thing. Oh, currently unavailable. It was on Amazon. I see. Oh, I found I found some parts. <laughs> Did it come in parts? What was the deal? I think I found one. It's $85 on eBay. Back around. That's too much. It's $85 on eBay and it ships is from it? Kentucky. Is it? Dear God, here's a link. Okay, is it too much noodles? Or 85 it, Or is it just enough? Lionel Coin Bank. Lionel Coin Bank. Holy shit. And you know what I was now. Uh, you know looks... what I pay money for? Zupel plates. There's some damage on the main, is what it says. That's it, Britt. It looks like it. Damage on the main unit where the battery cover screws in. Damn. But it is the Lino needs, coin it bank. Needs, it needs light bulbs. But it is the Lino coin bank, though. But it is the Lino coin I'm bank. I'm going to buy it now. <laughs> no. No, I'm not. <laughs> You know, I the need thing to, is, is I, I need to be part of the Lionel thing. Coin Bank cult, okay? Lionel Coin, Coin Bank. Coin Bank, Lionel, save your money, save your money. <clears throat> okay, who here actually owned a on TV product? I had an Easy Bake Oven. That's not a as seen on TV product. Oh, no? No, that was uh that was it, it, that Easy Bake was a retail thing. They sold that everywhere. Mm. I mean, you probably saw a shit ton of commercials for it. I sure did. Yeah. I sure did. Yeah. No, uh, an example of an as seen on TV product would be something that you can very rarely find at a retail store. At least they tell you you can't find it at a retail store, and then you go to Walmart, you see that Walmart has all of them. And then it says mm -hmm. as seen on TV. And it says as seen on TV. Believe me, because I had to set that a few times when I worked at Walmart. Um, I, I have a pillow pet too, actually. 
I He's also, a turtle. Pillow pet is mm. not. Oh yeah, my sister had a pillow pet. Oh damn it! I have to wait for the sand to fill up so I can pass past these cactuses. I think. Yes, yes. I got my mom the Betty Crocker bacon fill ice cream cake maker. Hmm. I know the Betty Crocker bacon fill well. Tuna salad cake. Shut up. My mom made. What? Toodles, were you not here for the cake stream? I was probably at work or something. Probably. I did um, a I did a Betty Cracker Bacon Fill stream and I made a cake. I do remember you prepping for that. Brit made I think I missed the actual stream. Britt made fun of me because Britt says it looked like a like a like a tuna salad. Actually no, I, I called it concrete, but chat kept calling okay, it tuna okay. salad okay okay you weren't cake. consuming cake flavor cake and tuna salad together that was my concern i'm gonna run out of fucking oxygen before these fucking cactuses get covered over i don't think those no I think that's an end no 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 i don't think so but but yeah my mom made some ice cream cakes nice um can't really think of anything else. I had the steam buggy. The what? It was like a steam cleaner vacuum thing. Oh, yeah, 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 I remember that. Yeah. I, like, begged my parents to get it because I thought it looked so cool. I was, like, ten. <laughs> <laughs> you wanted a steam cleaner when yeah, you were 10? Yeah, because I thought it was fucking cool. They showed in the commercial and it was like cleaning shit. Like, oh, cool. I want this. They did buy it and it ran like shit and we never used it. And then we threw it away. <laughs> the end. Now, I, I, the weird part isn't that you wanted it as a 10 year old. The weird part is that your parents bought it for you. <laughs> I think because it was only 20 bucks. I wanted those markers that you could like twist the colors into each other. Yes. Oh, I had those. I had those. Oh, oh, you know what? I had, it was some sort of I'm Crayola thing where you blow on the markers to make, like, airbrush. Oh, I wanted that too! Why is there cum falling from somewhere? It was... <sighs> I'm ignoring that. It was garbage because, um... Well, it wasn't garbage so much as whenever I had straws as a kid, I always had the bad habit of chewing on them, so I chewed it closed, and then you couldn't blow any air through it, and then it was oh, closed. Fuck it. I'm just gonna die. I, I swear, Britt, you gotta go that way. There's definitely something past there. And I think you gotta wait for the sand to fill it up. I, if it's if there's that much cactus and there's a, a sand thing you can't get past, I don't think you can go past that. No, it's just pushing me down. It's not that I can't get past it. So I think I can walk through it if the sand covers the cactus. It doesn't. Fuck! Thank you, Nat. I don't understand this planet. It's so confusing. I hate it. It makes me crave death. Anyways, I'm going back to Dark Bramble. <laughs> <laughs> because I crave death, and I wish to be eaten by an anglerfish. <laughs> <laughs> they fucked up that fucking launch again. Go to the one that's emptying, then. Yeah, but that's just a, a lot of waiting around. Oh, there goes the probe. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm running out of things to do in Breath of the Wild. Fight Ganon! <laughs> no! Why is, that, fight why is that everyone's biggest fear in that game is to fight Ganon? No, no, that's not my fear. It means the game is over. Yeah, go your biggest mop. fear. I think for correct seats. Go get a mop and fight a Lionel with it. 
That just sounds a wino, like a bad time. Lino coin bank? Yeah, go get a mob and beat a Lionel coin bank. Lionel <laughs> coin bank, Lionel coin bank. Save your money. <laughs> What I really need to do is finish a Zelda save game. Save your I rupees. Just, got, save your rupees. <laughs> I don't need to save my rupees. I've got 50,000. See? Is that a lot? Yes. I would Did you know. buy the house in that one village? Yeah, that was the first thing I did. <laughs> I did that before I talked to Empa practically. Um, Get a bunch of one item and fill that house with it. Do items not despawn? Fuck. I mean- GOD! Ryan, you have to be better at this. Brick, you, you have to shut the fuck up! Just be better, Ryan! Oh, forehead, forehead! Be better, forehead! <laughs> I was really hoping that ship was getting sucked into a bramble hole. <laughs> Just be better, forehead, they say. You're also mean. No, nah, I've, I've got stuff to do in Breath of the Wild. I still gotta do the shield surfing challenge. And I haven't gotten all the shrines, and there's one shrine quest I'm stuck on. What the fuck is broken? The Everything. reactor. No, the reactor isn't broken. It only beeps like that if the reactor is broken. No, I'm telling you, it said it did not say the reactor is broken, Britt. Okay. I will show you. Landing gear. That's all it says. Inside? Oh, the reactor's <laughs> inside. Where? Pretty sure it's by the gravity crystal. Looks fine to me, motherfucker. Okay. I hope you go to fix the landing gear and it explodes. It- Oh, it beeps only when the reactor's broken! It usually does. Okay. We're going in. Yeah, it looks like a butthole. <laughs> Thanks! Thanks for the input, asshole. <laughs> exactly! Uh-oh. Uh Hole! Hole. see a guy. Oh, that's a little too much thrust. Could this be the horror? Yes. Are we peeping the horror? Yeah. Keep it well. <laughs> You're looking at it. If I match velocity, is it gonna... <clears throat> I don't know if I agitated it. I did, floor it! <laughs> Can't get me in here, motherfucker! Yes.
What at? Oh, it's another one. What are those lights? What are those lights? What the fuck is this? <laughs> are those all seeds? Yeah. Like bram bramble seeds? Either bramble seeds or anglerfish oh, eggs. Oh, either way, I hate it. Should I not fly into these? Um, I think there's another... There's something in here. Massive caviar. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Uh, check to see if there's something inside them. No, they're just giving off light for some reason. Okay, now what? Um... Oh, there's a bramble branch next to ya. I'm not picking up any signal. Well, wait. Turn. Hmm. So that's where you came from. Yeah. Turn to your right. Let's head towards that way. Okay. I mean, is there another light? <laughs> Funny red box joke. How do you miss every single joke I say, Grim? I was watching a video. I said, is there another light? And then I started humming another light. This one looks pretty important. <laughs> How? <laughs> it is a massive hole! Let's just fucking floor it. Just get past the load point, please. Okay, I'm seeing two lights now. There are two lights! Oh. Well, one of them just went out. So, oh, it's behind a branch. I guess I'll go to this one? Yeah. Oh, there's a lot of branches. Still nothing on the signal scope. You have the signal scope to Outer Wild Venture Ventures, specifically. Yeah, how do I get rid of that? Change frequency. Left and right on the D-pad. Yeah, but I want to, like... You're looking, you're looking for Distress Beacon. Oh. Okay. I didn't realize there were different modes. I didn't either until I just saw it. Ryan, check the music channel when you can. Okay. God damn it! <laughs> <coughs> this is new. Or did he just go in the same hole again? Go to the mm, bottom left that's one. A good point, yeah. I don't think there's any anglerfish here. But I could be mistaken. I hope you're ready for an unforgettable luncheon. That's me to the anglerfish. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the unforgettable luncheon. They'll forget about you every 22 minutes. That's true. I'm the forgettable luncheon. Oh. Hey, Brett. Yeah? That wasn't a, that wasn't a seed. Okay. If I look up map of the dark bramble, will it actually get something for me? Why no play bank? Why no play bank? Why no play bank? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> this edit is... <laughs> the fact that... It's... <laughs> it's so 
what's happening in this movie. Oh, God. That's really good, Merm. Oh, God. Here's a map for you. Look at this map. Oh, ow! What is this? <laughs> that is the <laughs> map of the Dark Bramble no, I could find. Oh, there's too much. That's too much. Oh my god, what? Oh, that sucks. I'm not doing that tonight. <laughs> Doodles, what are you doing? Oh, you were on loop room. The... the beep? Or what? the... No, you were rustling. <laughs> that was me sitting back down on my bed. Oh yeah, duh, you can use your... stupid scout launcher to figure out where things go, too. Oh! Yeah, I forgot about that. How long have we been live? I gotta go to bed soon. I think I'm gonna stop. Okay. We made some progress tonight. We finally are finished with Brittle next, Hollow. Next time we're doing more DLC shit, I promise. Yay. We're almost done with this game, guys. I promise. Well, we need to do a lot of Ash Twin stuff No, first. I promise we're almost done, guys. I promise. Before I go... Is it Lionel Coinbank? No. I was going to post it out. Here we go. The the Breaking Bad frames spot got to the part where Jesse's passed out high and Walt breaks a door to get into his apartment. <laughs> Jesse! Jesse, wake up! That was an even better... That was an even better frame. Hold on, where is it? I saw it earlier. <laughs> there it is! Jesse! 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 Wake up, Jesse! <laughs> okay, bye. 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 Alright. Bye, guys. Uh, we'll probably... Like I said, in lieu of a stream tomorrow, uh, I'm probably going to just upload that best of video and we'll probably set it to a premiere on uh, YouTube and we'll just uh, watch that. So probably no stream tomorrow. He's crumping. That's the thing. And one of the replies, I was literally going to reply with the I'll crump with you, sweetie, but that's like three of the replies. So I was like, alright, there's the point. Yes, he's literally doing the I'll crump with you, sweetie, pose, and it's fantastic. Alright. Uh, I'll see, I'll see you guys later. Don't say. <laughs>